we go. Eek. I've been uh, thinking about what you were saying about doing something to make a difference around here, pay back the camp. I'm listening. Do you got a few minutes? I want to show you something. Yeah, guess I can spare you a minute or two. He's going to show him his wiener. So where are we heading? You ever been out to the caves north of the lake? I know. Come on, see if you can keep up. Okay, let's go. Are we? Are we? Okay. Are we? Is it a race? It's a. This ain't much of a race. I'm also pushing. I got march duty anyway this morning. Gotta see if any freaks are stuck in the muck out that way. When's the last time you went up there? In a few years, I guess. Now the board used to live in that damn cave. The old man sort of fancied himself a geologist. Hmm. Sounds like we got a couple. Freaks stuck in the mud, I mean. Yeah, sounds like. What are Here, we let doing? Me take care of them. Yeah! All right. I guess I can let you do that. One down. <laughs> Two down. How stupid do you gotta be to get stuck in the mud, bro? Nice work. Schizo just found a new man for the job. You know what Schizo can go do. Anyway, as I was saying. Spend hours talking about how all these caves were formed when lava flows would harden on the outside, but the molten cores would still flow like buried rivers. Hmm. You got the big caves that drew in the tourists, like Metolius out there. There's way more than that. Riddled all over these parts. I have to see a few of them already. Okay, okay, we're coming up on the highway. We gotta be quiet. Okay, here we go. Ah. Right, oh, fuck. Jesus Christ! This is why you brought me out of here? Smell a bunch of goddamn freaks? Yeah. Okay, okay. Come on, follow him. Wait, wait, wait. Follow him? Where the hell are we going? You'll see. Come on. I'm trying to get you killed, old man. Don't get too close. Stay down. Where are they at? Oh, I see him. What the hell are we doing, Deke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah. In July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. <laughs> well, you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer two, Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these whores. Every night there's a steady stream of them up and down the Sandy hmm. Highway. Thousands of freaks pouring into the Lost Lake Valley north of the Cascades. Did you think they're coming up from California? I always closed off. No one's been south of the Sentium Pass in years. It's not closed off to the hordes. Freaks Horse. are the reason it's closed off. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make is that the hordes come in every night, not a goddamn... Th wait, wait a second, wait a second. Of course they're blaming it on California! Of course they are! <laughs> oh, I live here and I don't even like do it. Stop. Look at that. Of course, all these zombies are coming from Cal. All the problems in every other state is California's fault. Lost more than a few men trying to back in the day. Yeah, I know. I was there. And every horde that comes through leaves a few stragglers or gets busted up and scatters and and just like that freaks everywhere as far as the eye can see that makes sense that makes sense you don't need to see them to know that they're around we figure out a way to stop the hordes coming through maybe we can make some headway reduce their numbers make it safer free up more farmland irrigation yeah 
Okay, so how do we do that? Hmm. Well, goddamn well, you can't take on a, a, a whatever you call it, a, a horde? This is how. I'll be goddamn. Yeah. They stand there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. So, what are you thinking that we. Yep. We blow it the hell up. Stick it down to my there. There and there, we'll bring down a mountain of rock. We seal this shit up. Yeah, so we trap a few hundred inside. What good is that gonna no, do? No, no, you don't get it. We seal this cave. Maybe they don't got no place to sleep. Or maybe this trail of piss and shit dries out, goes stale, and other stuff coming. Yeah. All right. It's a thought. All right. You get my attention. Okay. Come on. Let's head back. Good job, Austin Kutcher. All right. I need to warmed up a bit. Let's see if you can keep up. Um, I'm busy yeah, getting shit. Okay. Tell me, when does being out in the shit make you an expert on freaks? You spend your spare time just following them around, seeing what makes them tick? Not exactly. Are we, are we not talking now? And how do you know about all this? Oh, whoa, well, yeah, quick. What gonna do, where they sleep. A few days ago, I was riding north of Belknap Crater when a chopper flew by. A chopper? What the hell? Just listen to me. It was a black chopper. One of those Nero choppers that used to fly all over the goddamn place when the shit was going down. And you saw... I followed him. I found like three range. of them. I've been trying to track them down, see if they have a base around here. Supplies. Shit, I mean, see if the feds are still alive. You know what I'm saying? They're out here doing field work of some kind on the freaks. They're studying them. They got resources to do that while we're out here starving, fighting to stay alive. I followed them up to the grotto caves. You know the ones? Yeah. They had motion sensors set up. Measuring how many freaks used the cave during the day, and, uh, Mike, it was thousands. That right. They said freaks all up and down the Cascade Range, south of Crater Lake, and north up to Smith Rock, all used these lava tube caves to hibernate. So, hmm. we blow up those caves, maybe we have a few less to deal with. A few thousand? I like the way you think. Hey, this idea of yours, it's got some merit, but... A job like that, it's gonna take a fair amount of TNT. You said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer? This is how we do it. <sighs> All right. All right, look. There's some things I gotta do. Okay, but you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes. I know where we can find some. Oh, now everyone wants my fucking attention. Everybody. You're supposed to be up at the farm an hour ago. My guy said he's got a shovel waiting for you. Yeah, Schizo, about that, I'm busy. See, Iron Mike and I, we're just heading out on a run. You and Iron Mike. You'll get your ass up that way today, or you and your gimp boyfriend are gonna find yourselves out in the shit. You hear me? Without a goddamn battle. Today, everyone got yeah, yeah, I'll get right on that. Saint John out. You can imagine, right? I mean, I was teaching letters to a bunch of snot nosed first graders. I use the word teaching very loosely here. When this kid comes in late. Uh oh. He didn't. Another look story. Right. Sort of out of it. Next thing I know. He's biting a kid next to him, then another, and then another. I got help, and we got the kid sedated, took the others to the nurse, but it only got worse. Hmm. I swear, within a half hour or less, the kids were snapping at each other. Within an hour, the whole school was infected. Jesus. No one knew what to do. Hell, we didn't even know what was going on. 911 wasn't even picking up by then. I did the only thing I could. 
to get the hell out. You know what's messed up? That's not the worst story I've heard. No. Not even close. No, it's not. I wonder about the freaker sometime. Oh, well, I guess that's all I had to do. Let's go to the gate. Ready? Where are we headed? This time you're gonna have to trust me. Okay, where are we going? You know what they use to mine all around these parts? Yeah, uh, mercury or something. That's right, cinnabar. The extracted mercury from cinnabar. Folks back east think it was gold mines out here and silver. Not so. Back in the early 1900s, cinnabar was worth more than gold. To operate the mine, you need TNT for expansion, blowing out new tunnels, clearing okay. cave-ins, that sort of shit. And to own TNT, you had to register with me. Keep copies of the keys to all your lock boxes with the commissioner. Okay. Wait, the county courthouse? Where the hell is that? Thought you knew. It's in the old federal building. The old federal building. The one in Sherman's camp. Jesus, Mike. What the hell? You told me... You, you told me that you were never setting foot in that place again. Did I? I don't recall. You were drunk right after Joe was killed. Oh. Can I tell you why? No. Here. Turn right here. This is it. I guess he didn't tell me. He's not going to tell me why that sucks. Mike. The place is going to be crawling. I don't, I don't think this is a good idea. Uh, weather holds will be safe enough. All right. That there? It's the old federal building. That's where we're headed. Oh, the place that was closed off to me. Let's not go looking for trouble. Stay out of the buildings. Come on. We gotta head over this way. Okay, Mark. I, I kind of like you, so Small don't die. Lady. He'll be on the commissioner. And, and you know where he is? <laughs> where his body is? Yeah, I think I do. You heard what happened. Yeah, everybody got wiped out, man, woman, and child. Only a few got out, and, and uh, you, you were one of them, right? Only two got out. Me and Nora. But it wasn't the freaks that took us out. What do you mean? Here. Oh, shit, we got some secrets. <coughs> oh, shit. In. The ammo was gone. Two sides called a truce. A meeting. Right here. Oh no. Oh, we knew what was coming. We knew what was coming and we were prepared. Fight didn't last long. But it was bad. We had ammunition left after all, and... Well, they... Oh, hell, you can see what they did. Like I said... Damn. Two people walked out of this town after all was said and done. Some days. I wish the hell one of them wasn't me. Damn, Mike. Commissioner's over there in the bean counter suit. Go get the key so we can get the hell out of here. The one with a hatchet in his head. You didn't give a damn about sealing the caves. You brought me here because... Because you, you brought me here because you wanted me to see this. Not true. All right, you got the key. We're going to go get the maps to those mines, just like I said, and we're going to get more than enough TNT to seal every cave in the valley. I got Bullshit. it. Bullshit. You are right about one thing. I'm not sorry you've seen it. Not following you, Mike. I am talking about the war that's coming. With the Rippers, the one that Schizo saw. He cares how many die. 
on either side. Never mind. Come on. Oh, he's trying. I see. He's, he's no. He's trying not to. Door. He doesn't want that to happen again. Place is locked up tight. Guess not. Come on. Got to find a way upstairs. Well, it smells up like upstairs. something died in here. Newts. Yeah, I smell them. Bad business. Never much like kids. They always tended to get on my nerves. There's always a sore spot between me and my Elizabeth. God rest her soul. You didn't like kids. Wow, well, here I thought you liked everyone. Almost no one. Okay. All right, this is it. Now we got maps to every mine in the county mm. showing where they stored their dynamite. Okay, come on. Oh, listen to that. Hear that? Yeah. Weren't you expecting anyone? Nope. Do you have my back here? Hey, I don't like starting trouble, but I'll finish it if I have to. I like his gun. All right, Mike. Let's try not to let anything happen to you. Stay behind me. Hey, I can take care of myself. I'm not saying you can't, but remember the last time that we were out in the shit. Yeah, like I said, I'm staying behind you. More rippers. Uh, you know what? One down. Shit, he's dead. All right, you know what? Fuck it. Come here, bitch. That's all of them. Let's go. Right behind you. There's a fucking war going on. Freaks. Bring the whole goddamn town down on Fuck yeah. There's a oh, fucking yeah. sniper right over there. Here. Hey, don't... Oh, dumbass! No! Uh, here we go. Sniper isn't a problem no more. Mistake, jackass.
Jesus, what a mess! Eddie finds out you're out here risking your ass like this, she's gonna be pissed. Now, how would she find out about something like that? <laughs> Not from me. Get on the bike. Let's go. the rippers why you wanted me to see that shit nothing i always saw a bit of myself in you back in the day how's that you don't give a shit oh you care about your friend don't want to see him die but me any other goddamn person on the planet i don't think so caring will just get you killed yeah that's right thing is not caring will get you killed just as easy Hmm. Good folks of Sherman Camp did was stop caring about anyone but themselves and their own. Easy to kill a man when he's just some piece of meat standing between you and what you need. Schizo wants to kill Rippers because he don't think they're human anymore. They don't count. Standing in the way of what he wants. Well, I don't buy into that shit. I won't have it. You know, Schizo, he, uh, he wonders why I'm a pacifist. That's, you know, that's what he likes to call me. He, uh, he thinks I'm gonna get everybody killed. Well, are you, Mike, are you gonna get everyone killed? Freaks aren't gonna be around forever. Now, when they're gone, we're gonna need some folks around here to help pick up the pieces. Hey, look, hey, hey. I don't like Carlos and his rippers any more than I like Tucker or, or Copeland and his, his, his goddamn truthers. All right, but here, look. Here's the thing, Deke. I'm not going out of my way to kill any of them. I've had my share of killing. <laughs> Even if Carlos comes for you? My truce will hold. You can bet on that. Interesting. Interesting. Mm, all right, cool. <laughs> well, Mike, I ain't gonna bet on that. Your truce ain't gonna hold. Mm. Yeah, for once I agree with Schizo. The Rippers, they ain't human. Not anymore. St. John, this is Lost Lake. Come in. Yeah, Mike, this is Deke. Heard you brought in Shane Riley, but when I went to the shack to question him, he wasn't there. Uh, yeah, uh, about that, Mike. I tried to bring him in. I really did, but he, uh, well, he put up a hell of a fight. So no, he didn't dead. leave me much choice, Mike. He didn't. Uh, you remember what I said about how we do things around here? Yeah, yeah, Mike, I remember. Lost Lake out. No, he's not happy about that, is he?